What up, what up? Welcome to some smooth with R&B. I'm your host, Randy B, and ball is life. I mean, bars is life. Either way you put it, we're talking about cats at the top of their games, crossing over into entirely new fields. But are they really that much different? Think about it. From the true desire for greatness, to the versatility and styles, the bruisers on the block, to those that choose to finesse. The cultural impact on both sides makes it impossible to ignore. Every athlete wants to be a rapper and every rapper <laughs> wants to be an athlete. We'll take a look at the success of a few stars and the solid attempts <laughs> of a few others. On Monday, cast forward Amon Shumper went on Funk Flex and had something to say. They got my head spinning like mellow off the jab with the left hand. They treat me like a stepson, like ain't no sweat on my headband. They ain't spilt blood when it matted. They still fibbing on the cameras like I'm supposed to have manners. My nephew steady asking, why you got your shirt off? Cause I've been with the field niggas, I can't get the dirt off. But he's not the only one. Damian Lillard has been spitting for years now. From Four Bar Fridays to Freestyles with Sway to Features with Wayne. He's definitely made his presence felt. Always keeping it clean, his latest project confirmed. Tell the story of determination that any fan could vibe with. Shaq had bars. Even Kobe gave it a shot. And the list continues to grow. In today's game, the most notable baller in rap would have to be 2 chains. The 6'4 guard earned a full ride to Alabama State University, where he eventually graduated. Before he founded Death Row Records, Suge Knight bodied linebackers and found himself on an LA Rams roster during the lockout days. All that's fine and dandy, but I'd be remiss if I didn't include the greatest of them all, the legend, <laughs> the legend of Master P. In the prime of his career, the New Orleans native had a brief stint in the NBA. The year was 1998. Make him say, uh, oh, was blasting through your speakers. And Percy was making history. A rapper, baller, drug dealer turned businessman. He's the hood Bo Jackson. And a great example for the ambidextrous that try their hands down the road. That's real life <laughs> and motivation. If you don't have the bars, you can still shoot your shot, right? Hell no. Trash ass Damn, I guess not. I'm Randy B, and I'll catch you next go around. Baronian here.